Hey there guys, Neil here, back with a feature review. So for those of you who have, you are using Google Allo um, and you are a fan of trivia, then it has a fancy way to test your random knowledge in a few different categories. So what you'll do is open up Google Allo and it is as simple as doing a search for trivia. So you'll already see that I did a search recently for it. So if you do trivia and hit the arrow, it'll come up with a bunch of subjects of so vocabulary, um, smarty pins for geography, math, entertainment, geography. So um, all you have to do is t click on one of those uh, topics. It'll load a bunch of questions. I think it's like 10 questions and you get a normal or a hard option. So you'll uh, pick one of them and you go through them and you answer the questions so you basically just go down through them one by one as the answers are correct you, you'll see the green um, button with the character they play or whatever additional information is available um, and you'll get a bunch of points and it's just for your own random trivia to play um, those or to answer those questions and get points in those various categories um, I'm not sure um, what um, um, you get out of it as far as keeping track of score, but if you just want to answer random questions or um, if you want to if it if you want to just use it for your own trivia to have people answer questions, then it has its own um, um, countdown timer so you don't even have to have a timer you have you can just answer ask the questions you select the answers and you get the points at the end of it so you know that so you can if for those who get it right you can answer um, though so you have the key and keep track of points and all of that stuff so um, that's basically um, the um, bulk of the um, features of trivia and you can switch from one bunch to a, a, other if you want to review it'll give you um, a review at the end so if there's questions you miss and you want to see the answers again if you want to um, um, just keep track of the scores you can do that but so as you can see I got 6 out of 10 correct I got 506 I've played the um, entertainment trivia quiz before I got a slightly higher score um, and then scrolling up a little bit you can review your questions and um, you can see the answers again and if you like the questions and you want more you can do more like that if you don't then you can don't you don't have to do that if you find something that's inaccurate I guess you can report it um, but that's the bulk of that um, the other one that I kind of like is a math quiz as well it's same features you're just answering 10 uh, math questions so if you want to test your uh, math and quick analytical skills and you can um, do that as well so as you can tell the normal is basically it's easy mode or hard mode nor they're just calling it um, normal so you know that it's nothing it shouldn't be anything um, extravagant so um, that's basically it and it's just a way to pass the time and be entertained and if you're for example going on a trip then you can do the geography quiz and have fun testing your knowledge in um, uh, geography and it is powered by Google Maps so um, you have that additional bit of a fun as well so that's really the bulk of the review I just I was looking for just random trivia as random facts so I probably should have just typed in random um, um, just to find random information I came across this so um, the, that's basically kind of where I was going with it so um, there is that but um, definitely worth checking out it's a good way to pass the time and it's 10 questions at a time so if you're if you want to play a com competitive game or you just want to play random trivia to enhance your knowledge then you can do that
So that's all there is for this review. So if you have any questions, comments, or anything like that, you can find me on Twitter at PatelN01. You can find this review and all video reviews on YouTube at youtube.com slash PatelN01. And of course, you can help support the show, the podcast, and help get more reviews like this by visiting the Patreon, patreon.com slash PatelN01. And of course, you can find links and all that good stuff on the website at PatelN01.com. But that's all there is for this review. Thanks for watching and listening, and until next time.